When barbell squatting, you want to have a pretty good mastery of hip hinging and squatting without any kind of weight. To set yourself up, have your hooks set at about mid-shoulder level, and you'll want to have some kind of safety rack set, even though this one's a little bit short. If you have a standard rack, like at a gym, make sure that you're setting those racks, those uh, bars, in a pretty good position. Generally, you're trying to squat as low as you can without causing injury. If you need a limited range of motion, maybe set your safety rack up a little higher. Um, if you have no restrictions, then put it out as low as it can go, just making sure that you stay within that range. So pretend that this is a little bit longer. In order to set yourself up, walk up to the bar. Remember, you can either have a squat sponge on it or you can have it flat with nothing on it. Walk up and place yourself underneath the bar. Back is arched. Shoulder blades are pulled back. Grab hold of the bar and feel like you're actively pulling it down on your spine. That way it stays secure. Walk yourself away from the hooks, but try to stay within the safety racks if possible. From there, you'll have some variations as far as your foot width. It depends on what your goals are, which specific muscles we'll be targeting. So for right now, my, my feet are actually a little wider than shoulder width because that's a good, um, comfortable position for me. From here, your butt will hinge back as you sit down and come back up. Staying within a comfortable range of motion. If you do have a slight butt wink, that's okay. But try to make sure that the weight doesn't shift forward onto the knees. Instead, keep the weight shifting backward, staying on the heels. And the trajectory of the bar should be right over the midfoot. So you should feel that the bar actually makes a straight line and draws a line all the way down toward the middle of your foot and then stays over that, over that foot almost the whole time. Whenever you're finished, walk yourself back forward and place the bar back on the hooks with your back still flat so that you don't cause any injury by being lazy.